everyone. Welcome back from my channel. channel. So today, let's solve sine x minus 1 dx1. What is the integral range from 0 to pi over 2, both x and y? So first, we have to integrate with x, 0 to pi over 2. All right, so when we, when we integrate x, we will get minus cos. Or when we integrate sine, we get minus cos x minus 1. dx dy. dx dy. Okay, so, and the way, wait, 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 sorry. We don't need to put dx again, sorry. We have to put the interval here, 0 to pi over 2. Okay, so let's insert the value of x here, so we will get minus here, minus 0 to pi over 2. Wait, 0 to pi over 2. Cos pi over 2 minus y. Cos pi over 2 minus y. Minus. This is. Okay, minus cos minus 1, because when we insert 0, we will just get minus 1. All right, and we have to integrate with d1 again. So, minus here. 0 to pi over 2. All right, so when we cos a minus b will be here, you, we all can see minus will be plus, cos a cos b plus sine a sine b. So cos a will be cos pi over 2 into cos b will be cos 1. Minus will be plus sine pi over 2 sine y sine y minus cos minus y is equal to cos y. All right, we can simplify this stage to be more easy to solve the y. All right, so cos pi over 2 is cos pi over 2 is 0, sine pi over 2 is 1. So this all will get zero and this will get one. Oh no 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 this will get just this sine pi over 21 and we will just it will just remain sine pi. Zero two pi over two. All right, so let's multiply with minus so minus x minus cos y. So we will get plus cos y. Minus sine y. And we have to integrate with integrate with y again. Okay, so let's integrate y. When we integrate cos, we will get sine y. When we integrate sine, we will get minus cos. So minus and plus, minus and minus are plus. Cos y and the value of my range from 0 to pi over 2. All right, so let's solve this. So let's insert the value of one here. So sine pi over 2 plus cos pi over 2. Wait, what just said? Plus cos pi over 2. Minus sine zero will get zero. Minus cos zero will get one, right? So this is zero. So sine pi over two is plus one and minus one. Okay, so the answer is zero. If there is any question, please let me know. So thank you and see you in the next video.